Yo, what's good YouTube? It's your boy TJ. Okay, and as if you've read the video uh, title already, you can see what it says. It's critique my deadlift. And the reason that is, is because I don't deadlift. If you've watched the channel, you've seen that I've never shown myself deadlifting in, in anything, as far as I'm aware, if I remember. And that's because I haven't done deadlifts in about, I'd say eight months. Eight months I haven't done deadlifts. And when I did do them, I did Romanian deadlifts, AKA the straight legged or stiff legged um, um, deadlifts, whatever you want to call them. Uh, but now um, the reason I stopped is because I didn't. I switched to my routine, and because I wasn't seeing that much results in it, um, visual wise. As in, I saw strength gains, but I didn't see much visual results. Now it's because I had a lot of lower back um, fat. I couldn't see much results, which is why I stopped. Which isn't a reason to stop. So if you are out there, listen to me. Don't stop. That's not a good reason to stop. Uh, you know what I mean? In the words of Chris Jones, that's some hippie ass. That's a hippie ass move. I shouldn't have stopped. But yeah, I did. So obviously, I want to get back on it now. But when I get back on it, I want to do conventional deadlifts and I've never done them before. And Rizzy is not about, he's at uni at the moment, trying to get a degree. And I know his deadline really soon, which is why you've mainly only seen me. He's still about, he's just uh, focusing on uni, so I'm not even going to mention any PMG business to him until he finishes that. You know what I mean? Education comes first. But yeah, that was a nice quote there, wasn't it? But yeah, anyway. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna get back on to doing conventional deadlifts and the only things I've been using as a guide is other YouTube videos. I think I watch a good few people and to get that the principles and like, and then to more or less learn how to do it. Obviously in practice it's different, which is why I've watched the videos a good few times, tried to replicate the movement and watch they did, um, that a lot of people said it was a great form. So I'll try to do that myself. Um, obviously, and I was, gonna look at, I was looking at myself doing it in the mirror when I was at the gym, but when you start turning your head to do it, it kind of puts you off balance a bit and it kind of threw me off, so I thought, screw it. I'll just film myself doing it from a few different angles and let my subscribers know. I didn't want to like ask someone in the gym, how do you do this? Because then they'll they'll try and they'll probably forever look at you like they're more superior than you. And one day I may come into the gym doing something perfectly fine, they'll walk over, no, that's not how you do it. No, I don't want any of that business. So I thought, fuck it, let me just film it do my things, do my thing, and like ask you guys, cause you like are my people, you like are cool. So I thought, yeah. From what I saw, from the side view, cause I did two shots from the front and from the side. From the side, I personally didn't think it was that, it was bad. I don't think, I don't know if it was great, but I don't think it was bad. My back wasn't like curved and hunched or anything like that. I made sure to keep my, my shoulder, my chest out and my shoulders kind of pinned back when I was doing it. So it wasn't no hunched back and notched down shit going on. Uh, yeah, but from the front, I did notice that when I lift up, my legs sometimes buckle inwards. I'm not sure whether that's because of my feet positioning or or what, but it, it tend to keep doing it like every so often. Um, it wasn't until like I realised after like after I started filming, start filming, sorry, that I noticed it happened because I was doing it from the mirror when people move out the way and I had space like straight onwards. Um, so yeah, so let me know um, what you think of the form. Feel free to critique me, man. Just don't be a prick. <laughs> yeah, I'm just joking. But yeah, don't be a prick. Like, feel free to point out things I'm doing wrong. Just don't come out with some bullshit ass line like oh you that was terrible man no actually if you said it was terrible I wouldn't mind as long as you have like respect because I've had people in the past that have commented on the odd video with like some dickhead response and that's not what PMG and this channel is about we don't mind criti criticism in the, the day we're not professionals we're not experts but just be mindful that don't get yourself blocked I'm joking we're gonna block you we know we'll just call you a prick um but yeah uh critique my daily tell me what you think of it tell me what you think I can do to improve it as well uh, at the end of the day, yeah, we teach each other, like, it's not just us teaching um, you stuff, you like teach us stuff. If you see where we can improve, feel free to go, oh, oh nice attempt, but so and so and so, you could do better by doing this. At the end of the day, I want, I want, to, I want games, you know what I mean? I'm not going to be a dickhead and be stubborn and be like, um, oh, screw whatever you say, I know I did it perfect. I know I didn't. I, I don't know how good on the scale of 1 to 10 it would be, but I don't think it was absolutely terrible. From, cause from the side, I made sure my back tends to look straight nearly every time in the, every point in the movement. It doesn't like get any big curve, no hunchback, a notch of damn shit, you know what I mean? So hopefully it wasn't too bad, so you lot don't say shit. But obviously I know there's areas where I can prove, especially with the, uh, the, the knees tending to go in. So if any of you know a tip how to stop that from happening, that'd be great. Um, but yeah, let me know in the comments below. Critique my deadlift, man. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. And, and hopefully you'll see more of me doing uh, deadlifts as well once I get the form on point. Uh, yeah, I think one of the next gym life episodes when we get them out, I'll, I'll make it a back day. I'll make sure to, to make it a back day because I don't think we've done a back day for gym life, a proper one, yet. So I'll do that next and after that it'll probably be legs. But yeah, so anyway, like, comment, subscribe. You know what I mean? In the end of it.
ain't hit em where I want it, but, but I don't want no trouble, trust me If you wanna trouble me, trust me, you can get it how you want it, but